Good enough. Thank you. Like <laughs> and subscribe. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> Channel. Okay, Bye. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I just want to do a little short video. Today is election day. Today's November 5th. I just want to do a little short, some, throw something out there in my opinion, which it don't count for much, trust me. You're going to have a lot of people complaining on either side, who wins, who loses, and most of those people didn't even vote. You know what I mean? So my opinion is just this right here. If you don't go out and vote, if you don't vote for who it is that you want to win or, you know, if you don't just vote in general, put your opinion in there. You're not entitled to complain. And that's my opinion. Uh, <clears throat> you know, most people will. Uh, there is uh, channels out there that saying that they this, that, the other, but they don't vote. But they want to complain about everything else. So why, why are you complaining if, if you didn't vote? So with that being said, Get out and vote, everybody. Vote for who you want. Vote for who you think is going to do the best job. I know who I'm voting for. I know who I voted for. I just went and voted this morning. And that's my opinion. And who you vote for is is entirely on you. You you vote with, with your heart and your gut. And, I mean, we'll see what happens. It's going to be a crazy day and a crazy night on news and social media and stuff like that. So it, it is what it is as far as elections. It's always that way. But this year just feels real, uh, this election feels real off by some reason. I, I don't know why. It just feels weird, uh, I want to say. It just feels weird. But with that being said, guys, uh, get out and vote. Do your part. And hopefully who you vote for will win. We'll see. And hopefully nothing, nothing happens. You got all these news articles and stuff coming out about Social unrest, rioting, you know, civil unrest, I guess the best way to put it, as far as no matter what side wins, you're going to see some type of turmoil come out of it. So as a prepper, I'm going to say I hope you're prepared for, you know, staying in for, you know, for a few days at least. At least have a few days supplies put up because if everything happens, you won't be able to get out. So anyway, guys, I hope nothing like that does happen, but if it does, just stay safe, protect you and yours and your family, and we'll see you again on the next one, guys. Thank you.